On the money watch, the Chicago company hopes to thrive despite making a product that's come under increased scrutiny this summer. We're talking about the plastic drinking straw. It seems like right now it is public enemy number one, according to environmentalists. Inside this factory on the far south side, machines spit out straws at a dizzying rate. So many that every year... The number of straws we produce is, begins with a B. As in billion. Bob Beavers is the chairman of Best Diamond Plastics, a company that's actually seen an uptick in business despite the anti-straw movement. Some of our competitors have actually turned off their, their, their straw machines. So we've seen an increase in our volume. Environmentalists point to images like these of some of the 500 million straws used every day. By 2050, we will have more plastic floating in our ocean than we have fish swimming in it. Some of the biggest corporations are taking notice and a stand by eliminating plastic straws altogether. Only five or six of these little pellets will make a straw. Mark Tolliver is the president of Best Diamond. He shows us the raw materials needed to create a single straw. Then the straws are wrapped in paper. And gives us a tour of the factory floor. Now he believes his company has an answer to the straw dilemma that could be in your drink in the coming months. We have a product that will work and not hurt the environment. The old fashioned straw can take up to 200 years to disappear. But Best Diamond says its new version contains an additive that will allow the straw to break down in just two years. I look at it as an opportunity to grow and to improve a product that we believe in and that we make right here in Chicago. We reached out to the Shed Aquarium, which is fighting against plastic straws. While the Shed tells us it celebrates innovative solutions, it can't comment on whether Best Plastics Alternative is indeed a better option.